place ever since I was a little kid. I'm not lying to you. And uh, in order to live with this fear, I don't drink. I'm 25, so I could, but I don't drink because I'm afraid it might make me sick. I don't like being in uh, bars and things like that where people might get sick. I'm very obsessed about looking at expiration dates. I've made a lot of sacrifices in my life in order to live with my fears. But as a performer, there's one thing I always really wanted to do, and that's swallow swords. Now, in order to swallow a sword, there are three gag reflexes you need to get past. There's one at the back of your throat right here. There's one at your epiglottis right here. And there's one at your stomach. In order to get past these, you need to trigger your gag reflexes so many times that they go away, that you desensitize them. And at any point in time in getting past this one, and this one, and this one, you can gag. You will gag. You will choke, and there's a possibility that you will throw up. Not that any of you should ever even think of trying this. But, yeah, it's real. <laughs> it's not sharp, but you go ahead and take Go ahead, check it out, pass it around. Just don't stab anybody with it. I'm taking that back. Check it out, this is not a toy. It is a real sword, but it is not sharp there. Okay, Justin, you get to uh, hold on to that, too. Justin, you want to get a picture? No, go ahead. I'm yeah, taking a picture of it. Looks all right. You sterilize yeah. that. We're going to sterilize it now. <laughs> <laughs> now, as I was saying, to get past those three gag reflexes, if you were to choke or gag while it's in your throat, one, you can throw up, which is...